Hey there, Zelda fans! Amanda Van Heil here with Zelda Universe for a breaking Zelda news. So this morning we got a Nintendo Direct, the first one we've had in quite some time. It was a very good one. There were, it was like over 40 minutes, tons of great announcements. There's new Fire Emblem on the way. There's a Kirby coming to the Switch. We've got new Pikmin. Um, Tunic, which is a Zelda-like game, will be coming to the Switch on the 27th of this month. And you should definitely pick that up because I think you're going to need something to tide you over between now and May 12th. Because you want to know what happens on May 12th? That's right, we got the release date for Breath of the Wild 2, which is now known as Tears of the Kingdom. So the new Zelda game, Tears of the Kingdom, we got to see a really cool trailer. I, people, I, I guess, looked sad in the paintings and it looked like there were some little tears on that, so I guess that's where Tears of the Kingdom came from. I guess I would be sad too if Ganon came along and destroyed my kingdom and left a bunch of sky islands everywhere. Looks so great, got to see Link just like bust out of there and jump on this really cool looking glider. Um, looks like runes are still a thing, it looked like one of, he was using stasis at one point. I saw some palm trees, so it tells me Luralan Village is back, glad to be back there because if I could live in any Zelda place it would absolutely be Luralim Village. Also, the, the uh, what do you want to call it? The title, the, the art thing. I'm really excited right now. I can't think of words, sorry. There's an Ouroboros around the title. Today I learned that an Ouroboros was not made up for Full Metal Alchemist. So, turns out it's a real thing, not just from Full Metal. So, yeah. <laughs> Dragons are going to be back, hopefully. I, I can't imagine why they would have dragon Ouroboruses on the title if there aren't any returns of dragons. Or maybe they're Leviathans. I don't know. It just looks really cool. I know there's going to be a whole bunch of speculating. I know all you Zelda tubers out here are really excited to say stuff about the Zonai tribe, which I'm still learning about and still don't quite understand. But you know what? You want to theorize? Go for it. So once again, May 12th is when the new Zelda game comes out. I imagine they wanted to give it some time for the Mario movie hype to die down, for the Zelda game to come out. Otherwise, it totally would have stolen all the thunder of all that. All right, everybody. Well, thank you so very much for watching Breaking Zelda News. As soon as we get more information, we will absolutely let you guys know. Hopefully, we'll get like some cool pre-order bonuses that aren't just UK only. It'd be great if we got some in the US for once. Uh, <laughs> that's not be being, being bitter or anything like that. But as always, keep an eye on our website, zeldauniverse.net. Our YouTube channel here. You can also follow us on Twitch if you want to hang out with us as we stream cool games. And you know we're going to be streaming Tears of the Kingdom and probably going to stream some Tunic once it comes out on the Switch. So I will see you guys later. Have a great day. <laughs>